हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू फाइनेंशियल मैथमेटिक्स पार्ट फोर इन पार्ट थ्री वी टॉक अबाउट हाउ टू कैलकुलेट फ्यूचर वैल्यू फैक्टर एंड फ्यूचर वैल्यू एनर्जी फैक्टर इन दिस पार्ट वी विल डिस्कस सम क्वेश्चन ऑन दैट फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन मिस्टर एच ए इन्वेस्ट रुपीज टेन लैक नाउ इन एफ ही वॉन्ट टू फाइंड आउट the amount will be received after 10 years from this fund which pay interest at the rate of 10% per annum here rate of interest 10% number of periods are 10 and the amount in this is 10 lakh rupees for this we use only future value factor because the future value factor give us if we invest what to be right now how much amount we will receive after 10 years at the rate of interest of 10% so we use formula Equal ten lakh multiplied by future value factor. The answer is twenty five lakh ninety three thousand seven forty two point four six. Or we can use a simple formula. Equal the amount of investment multiplied by in bracket one plus rate of interest. Or raise to the power number of periods. And the number of periods here ten. And when we use this formula, answer is same. Now, second question. In this question, Mr. A J will invest rupees ten lakh at the end of every year for ten years. Find the amount will be received from the fund. Which pay interest at the rate of ten percent per annum. Now in this we are paying annually, so we'll use future value annuity factor because the future value annuity factor says if we invest one rupee every year for ten years, at the rate of interest ten percent we'll get fifteen point nine three seven. So here we use simple formula equal amount invested at the end of every year multiplied by Future value annuity factor, and the answer will be one crore fifty nine lakh thirty seven thousand four twenty four point six zero. Or we use a formula here equal investment amount at the end of every year multiplied by in bracket one plus rate of interest or raised to the power n number of periods. Minus one, all divided by rate of interest, and you will get same answer. Hope it is helpful. Thank you.